Hammer off! Dives on sail! Pull down and clue up! Through those mains! Come all you young sailormen, listen Who's to me. I'll sing you a song of the fish in the Man sea. And it's windy weather, Get the mains, stormy weather, when the wind blows. Full sail! Together, when the wind blows. Floating cargo for the taking, oh, sir. Jolly star-wester, boy, steady she goes. Jumps the hill where the slippery... Short sail! For sale! For sale! Just blew in. Hail and good morrow, gentlemen. Once again, Captain Cook's resourcefulness has served us well. I have located the man you were seeking. Adewale. Exactly. He was last seen in the French fort not two leagues from here along the river. What would that scallywag be doing in a French fort? Refitting his vessel, I suppose, after Louisbourg. Thank you, Master Cook. We'll take it from here. Farewell and Godspeed, gentlemen. The fort's just up ahead. Good. Let us continue onward. Loose and catch the wind! Loose topsails, gallants and royals! Storm, Captain! Looks bad! No sense. Those rivers barely have enough draft for an ocean going vessel. It should be nearly impossible to maneuver. Maneuverability is hardly the point. Well, I don't intend to find out the point. Let's stay out of her way. We can find our way around her. Just keep to the smaller rivers where she can't follow. And do try to remain unseen. We don't want to attract unwanted attention. Why would the French bring such a ship in with them? As the war is drawing to its close, they're becoming desperate. They'll expend any efforts to gain firepower. No offense to Captain Cook, but that lady has more firepower than any I've had the pleasure of meeting. It's not really my type. Ah, but the French ones can have a certain charm. But did I ever tell you the story of Madame Vrenette? <laughs> that wasn't her real name, but... Right, not in time. Point is, I think I know a safe place where we can debark. Sail on! So what's the plan? We bombard the fort? Captain's at the helm! It would be foolhardy to simply storm that fort. Aye, we need to know what we're up against. But I could take care of that. Indeed. Let's find a safe place to dock. Whose good is it to stop? 
I make my own luck, Master Kenway. Templars sent their dog after me. Time to test your metal, Jim. 
crois que je peux la tuer. it is. A novel tactic? He's saving his crew. No. He's making a last stand. Let's not disappoint him. Go after him, Shay. I will circle around. Forgive me, Adewale. You dare beg forgiveness, child? Hell welcomes traitors like you. The 
And I go there proudly, knowing I have done right. It does not matter. Achilles already has what he needs. I will kill every last man who defends him if I must. I cannot let him succeed. You have become a monster, she. Perhaps I have. Come. At this point, the wars aren't really over, but the French have lost their momentum in the colonies. The Templars can now focus entirely on the Assassins. They still have hundreds of men working for them in New York. Let us see what role Shay plays. What is our progress on the Precursor matter? We are gathering ships and supplies, but it is difficult without a specific destination. My men can help. I have enough to spare for a crew as well, Chevalier. Hope has found a way to reproduce Master Franklin's experiment. We'll soon uncover the next Precursor site. And you are confident you can do this? I am a keen observer, Mentor. The device will be ready shortly. Very good. Keep me apprised. We've yet to find where Hope is hiding, and most criminals in New York report to her now. I better find the Grand Master. Really? Things are worse than we feared. The Assassins found a way to make the Precursor Box work. They're already preparing an expedition. Then we must stop them. Hope controls hundreds of men. The authorities are doing sod all. What if we were to impersonate her men? We could commit a crime so big. They couldn't ignore those damned brigands anymore. That sounds like an excellent plan, Jack. Make it so. I will find out where the assassins are hiding. Is it just me, or did the boss tell us to make trouble? Enjoy it while you can, Shay. We'll need their clothes. You're right. Let's move. Hurry, you fool! Or we're both dead men! a disgraceful pair of crooks. No. I make this look good. So what's the target? The military pay. We'll have to hurry. A regiment is already on its way to the fort where the coins are kept. Great. And I suppose you have a plan. The fort holds many prisoners. Get in and hoist the gang's colors. When you do, I'll free them. You're going to free a bunch of criminals working with the assassins. Well, 
We have to turn the army against them, don't we? Remember, you raise the flag, and I'll raise hell! Clear shot on it. Oh, where do you think you're going? <sighs>
What on earth happened here? The prisoners got loose. They had help from outside. There were just too many of them. Well then, we're going to have to fix that, aren't we? It's about time we took those criminals down. Work, Jack. With a little luck, the army will crush those damn brigands. I make my own luck. Undesirable elements. No criminals, no French. But I wouldn't give. We're ready. Where is your boss? I'll never tell. She'll kill me. If you don't tell, he'll kill you. She's in that big mansion. The one with the gardens. Shall we go? You didn't mention you had a hidden blade. You thought you were the only one? Well, yes, I suppose. Where did you get that? It was donated by the Brotherhood. I see. My mission was a success. The army should make its move any time now. Good. We like the resources in New York to handle these criminals ourselves. With a little luck, we might be rid of them once and for all. I make my own luck. Now let us cut off the snake's head. Sir, we can confirm. The woman is inside. Perfect. I'll go in and get hold time myself. To smoke her Very well.
We have everything we need. Now, Chevalier will be expecting me. Hope. Bon voyage. About time you showed up. Sorry it had to come to this, Shay. You were a fascinating fellow. You have more endurance than I expected, Shay. What is this?
Again, Shay. Orb. I didn't want to do this. I trained you to do this. I expected nothing less. Then why? To give Liam time to leave. Soon Chevalier will be on his way to the Precursor site. I will stop him. He will see you coming. Pity. You had so much potential. What do you be needing today, then? My thanks for your trust, Captain. We're in the Atlantic again. Shay and the Templars are going after the Assassin Expedition. Go team! Yeah. 
Master Cormac. To what do I owe the pleasure? I was stopping to restock my ship when I heard the talented Captain Cook was here. We have a word. At your service, as always. I'm looking for a man. Captain Louis Joseph Gauthier, Chevalier de la Verandrie. The explorer? I have heard of him and his illustrious family. I must see him. Ah, <laughs> send him my regards. Or not. He sailed east a few days ago on a heading to Anticosti. Mm, indeed. I would advise caution. Oh, I've been there before. Then, I bid you good fortune. I will be sailing past Conception Bay, should you require further assistance. Much obliged. The Grand Master is pleased, Shay, what you did in New York. Yeah, it's only a matter of time now before order is restored. New York was never orderly, Gist. With hope gone. Perhaps. It couldn't have been easy for you, my lad. But you did what you had to do. I keep telling myself that. We are almost rid of the assassins in New York. And it's not as if the Hellcat didn't try to make you wear a pine overcoat. You had no other choice. I chose to cast my lot with the Templars. And we are glad you did, Shay. Who knows? Had you not, you might have found yourself at the end of Master Kenway's blade. Or yours. That's the spirit. Look, Shay. By killing Hope, you not only saved yourself. of New York from the Assassin's Poisons, you also learn the path we must take next. Now our task is simple. Prevent a group of Paper Skull killers from destroying another city. All in a day's work. A long day, guest. Not to be insensitive, sir, but what did you learn from the departed damsel? That she's cleverer than I even thought. Her whole ruse was to give Liam time to get back to Chevalier. They must have already set sail to a new precursor site. There may be an alternate route to the west! Anticosti is famed for its shipwrecks. They likely believe no one would venture into such dangerous waters.
these documents are nothing but blasted symbols and nonsense. That French devil was always one for sequence, but he has found the side of a great treasure. I'm sure of it. Stop! I'm Better head back to the Morgan. You'll have no arguments for me. Set sails! Make haste! We're over back, sir! The Royal Navy! Ah! Still can't get used to it. King George's men will take care of those pirates. We've got our own battles to fight. That was a far closer escape than I'm comfortable with, but we have what we came for. Then we know where Deliver Andre's ships are hidden. Not quite. But we have the means to find out. We'll need Cook to interpret these maps. Then we should set sail for the coast of Newfoundland. Oh, that's right. We will a man under call. Without 
Some evening I will tell tales about this voyage around a warm fire. This evening would be perfect. Master Cormac, I didn't expect to see you again so soon. I found Le Verandry's travel plans. But the devil used some kind of code I... I can't figure it out. Maybe you'll have better luck. How strange. This is a very old cipher. I have seen it once before. I could draw you a map. Or... You could accompany me. Help me find La Verandry. An urgent matter, then. Very well. We shall sail together again. I gather you have some history with our friend La Verandry? A history of instant loathing. I should have known not to trust my friends. ...who embraced such a wretch. My goodness, what could this fellow have done to inspire such enmity? I know him only as one of a family of explorers... ...extending the boundaries of the known world. From the brief encounters I've had, I can tell you he's an irascible person. Did you hear that? Cannon fire. Deep within the fog. Could it be de Lavarandri? Perhaps. This is a secret expedition. They won't be keen to leave any witnesses to their voyage. Crowd on every inch of sail! Loose capsules, gallants and rowers! Brief it on tops! Set to full! Fire! Good shot, finish them! Fire! 
Take them by surprise. Brace! It's an ambush! Steady the ship! Where are they? They're within mortar range, that's all I know!
So you think you can best me, boy? So, cabbage farmer, are you still convinced the Templars are right? Convinced to the end. Oh. You bastard! Achilles and Liam have already headed north! Hope was right. <laughs> I do make a good distraction. <laughs> Thanks for your help, Captain Cook. You're welcome, Captain Cormac. Sailing with you is certainly, um, interesting. Well, trouble does seem to find us, it's true. In Tell me the truth. Are you fellows with a larger organization? The Board of Admiralty. You take your orders directly from His Majesty, don't you? We couldn't tell you, even if we were. You should have these maps. The Levet Andre won't need them anymore. We'll contact you in regards to sponsoring future voyages, Captain. Much obliged. Get the maids free! Loose all the trip! Billy Riley, words of dancing master. Oh, Billy Riley, 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 master of a drover. Oh, Billy Riley, oh, Billy Riley, oh, Billy Riley, oh, Billy Riley, master of a drover bound for Antigua. Oh, Billy Riley, oh, Billy.
Master Kenway! The Lavelle Andre's dead. I have the coordinates. I know where the assassins are going. Then, let us make haste. Do you think Achilles and Liam have found the precursor site? The world is still standing. If they uncovered it, they have not yet set the earth in motion. How gentlemanly of them. There should still be time. Master Gist, stay here. I shall accompany Shay. Sir, with respect, are you sure that's wise? As Grand Master, I must investigate this precursor matter to the end, and witness the death of Achilles' brotherhood. If the assassins do trigger an earthquake, at least there's few around to suffer. I have no intention of letting your former colleagues destroy a precursor site, regardless. <gasps> this would be beautiful if it wasn't so damn cold. Tread carefully. Some of this ice is rather thin. That's a hefty crew Achilles brought. I doubt he expects all of them to survive these conditions. That's bleak. But we're still outnumbered. Let's keep a low profile, avoid unnecessary fights. Your assassins would scarce recognize me. Find another way.
should keep a low profile and see how things turn out. Is this the apple? No, don't touch anything. She was right. What would he know? More than me, apparently. Finally, you understand. Achilles. This is a structure to hold the world together, not a weapon to control it. This whole calamity could have been avoided if you'd only listened to me. 
disrespectful to the end. Yes, we've been working on that. Right or wrong, Shay. You betrayed the Brotherhood, Achilles, and me. Says the man who shot me in the back. At the homestead. That was Chevalier. I don't miss! The young gods! <laughs> Do I have to tell you, Liam? I make my own luck. How do you do that? You bastard. You broke the assassins. Betrayed everyone you knew. You sided with our worst enemies. And for what? <laughs> to save the world. I hope that world is a good one. Why not? Achilles is harmless now. A mentor with no followers. What kind of world are we making if we cannot show mercy? Besides, he understands what these precursor sites are now. Without him, the assassins may continue their search. 
Valid points. Never forget what has happened here. I won't. But the world will. So what happens now? Master Gist will be in charge of eradicating any remaining traces of the assassins. Master Weeks and the others will assist him, of course. Achilles has lost everything. He won't dare leave his homestead. He won't. Shay, although our search for precursor sites is at an end, I want that box. You will find it for the Templar Order, and for me. It could be anywhere in the world by now. It may take years to find it. It may take your lifetime. Are you up for the challenge? Good. <laughs> Incredible. Who knew that Shay had that kind of potential? I have everything I need to complete our assignment here. One last job, Nubskull. We need you to upload Shay's story. But not to Helix. I want some very specific people to see what we have found here. To reward you for your services to me, I am granting you level 3 security access. From this point on, no doors will be closed to you. In the distant past, the assassins had a noble goal, that of peace. But over the centuries, that goal eroded into a far more dangerous one. Freedom. Shit! There! Just follow those lights and you'll be set. I promise, you won't die if you follow the bright lights. I haven't steered you wrong yet, have I? Follow the lights. Please hurry, Numskull. It all comes down to this. Your communicator should work now. The Assassin Brotherhood still exists today, and they remain dedicated to their foolish cause. I am a Templar Knight. I protect the world from the Assassins. Today, you have helped me to fulfill this role. Please, restore the service. Otso Berg, the big star of the Animai training program. Show me what you've got, you arrogant prick. If you insist, Master Cross. I believe that my training will soon be complete. Wouldn't you agree? <laughs> What's so funny? I was wrong about you. You're not arrogant. You're just deeply fucking stupid. Oh, your body, your mind, they're not yours anymore. You understand? All you have left are the voices. I don't suffer from your condition. 
My animus sessions were carefully... No, no, no! My voices are ghosts! Dead! So they can only ever say the same things over and over and over and over! But the ones in your head will never die. And they own you now. I am the Order's humble servant. You're not even a person anymore! You're a tool! A weapon! A plaything! We're done here. And in the glorious New World Order, there won't be any room for broken toys like us! You have exceeded my every expectation. Use that terminal to upload Shay's story to the Assassin Network. Haiti happened in Portugal. A great earthquake. Thousands dead next to your damned manuscript. Get him out of here. I want them to know how weak they truly are. And I want everyone to see them suffer. So on the day they finally meet me, they will welcome the death I offer them. She was right. What would he know? More than me, apparently. plan is in motion. I have no further demand to place upon you. However, Shay's story is not complete. I would ask that you see it through to the end. I am super impressed, Nobskull. You really came through for us. And yes, I am also a Templar. Have been for years. Shay's data left to explore. It's a bit of a trip, but I think you should see it. Once you go back to finish Shay's story, your life is never going to be the same afterwards. You should finish any outstanding business before entering your animus. The Royal Palace at Versailles, Louis XVI and Marie Antoinette in residence. Such decadence. Good luck, Numskull. Certainly look prepared to meet royalty. Perhaps King Louis himself will grant you an audience. I doubt even these breaches will get me into the King's chambers. Besides, I'm only here to see a business acquaintance. Yes, I heard a group of merchants would be here today. They might come see my scientific demonstration later. They really should. They might learn something. Though I wouldn't count on their being present. I take my leave. Thank you again, Master Franklin. Now to find Charles and that damned box.
That's him. Charles Dorian. Sorry, sir. The palace is closed to visitors at the moment. Please return tomorrow. So I'm supposed to be in a meeting right now. Then you should already be inside. Come back and sell your food tomorrow. Oh. Lucky for him, I can find another way in. important business with the king. What should we do now? Gentlemen, I'll protect this artifact with my very life. Arno? You're the traitor. I'm just finishing old business. Connor and his assassins. The American Revolution undid your Templar business. And perhaps we shall start a revolution of our own. <laughs> Uphold the principles of our order. And all that for which we stand, never share our secrets, nor divulge the true nature of our work. Do so until death, whatever the cost. This is my new creed. I am Shay Patrick Cormac, 
Templar of the Colonial of the American right. I am an older man now, and perhaps wiser. A war and a revolution have ended, and another is about to begin. May the Father of Understanding guide us all. It's my pleasure and privilege to welcome you up here today. Gotta hand it to you, numbskull. You proved yourself to be more than a simple research monkey. The data you extracted from Shay Cormac's memories has served us well. Shay's story is a message. One that says that when threatened, what an assassin truly wants isn't freedom, but order. And we represent the highest order there is. Whatever you learn from your Animus experience only scratches the surface. We have existed since before recorded human history, and have recently been reborn, disguised as Abstergo Industries. And entertainment. You have crossed the threshold, and your eyes have been opened. You have seen the world for what it truly is. There's no turning back now. We got big plans for you. The Father of Understanding guided you to us. And for that, we are grateful. The test of your true worth begins now. And it begins with a choice. Join us, and a bright future will be all yours. Refuse.